Hey everybody, Derek Pierce here, and in this video, we're going to be going over launch jacking. What is launch jacking? How does launch jacking work? And is this an affiliate marketing strategy that you can rely on and build a business with? I'm going to be showing you three key elements that you've got to have with your affiliate marketing using the launch jacking type strategy. Now, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe to the channel. I release new videos every single week on digital marketing. I would love to have you. Also, I put together a free video training on how I built an affiliate marketing business and how you can too, even if you don't have a big following and you don't have a big email list or anything like that. You'll find the link to the video training below in the description. I'd love to see you there as well. Now, let's go ahead, let's dig into the computer and I'm going to show you exactly how to pull this whole launch jacking strategy off. So product launches have become a really big thing, especially in the digital marketing community. Now, even outside of the internet marketing community, you will find that there's launches that are going on. Now, what happens is, is everybody tries to get affiliates or joint venture partners on board. And what happens is, is they mail, you know, like teaser type content and they mail, you know, usually it's good stuff, usually good content. And what they're doing is they're in an effort to build up some anticipation and some momentum. And then they launch the product to the world and all the affiliates that have mailed for that particular product, you know, what they're doing is they're just creating some sort of anticipation and some excitement. When they release the product, boom, there's a bunch of sales that go, go on and it happen. And so what happens is, is a lot of times there's affiliate contests and things like that, especially in the digital marketing space. But what happens is, is they're jockeying for these these product sales because they're going to get paid a commission on. So you have a lot of people that have big email lists that are mailing and mailing and mailing more uh, because they can actually make money just from send, sending some emails. Well, what happens a lot of times in these launches, especially the ones that are taking off, is there's some there's some spillover. In other words, what happens is these people are getting mailed, you know, by you know 10, 15, 20 different people all about the same types of products. And so what they're going to do is people are going to go to Google. They're going to go to Google and they're going to do a search. They're going to do a search to find out more information because in most cases, if you look at, especially in the digital marketing space, in most cases, what they're doing is whenever they get ready to launch the product, they will put out what's called a swipe file. A swipe file is nothing more than a collection of emails that they're suggesting to send that outlines the benefits and the features of the actual product. And it's sending them to you know a landing page or to a video and sometimes to a webinar. What happens is, is a lot of people will just grab that swipe file and they won't modify it. They won't look at the product. They don't review the product. They don't see what, how they can make the product better or anything like that. And so what happens is everybody's getting the same emails over and over and over again. And so what people do is, is as, a, as a user, they're going to say, okay, well, this product looks interesting. And you've probably even done this yourself. This product looks interesting. I'm going to go to Google. I'm going to see if I can find out more information about it, more details about it. So at that point, the people that are mailing have created some anticipation, created some excitement and some buildup for the actual product name, which if someone's doing a search for a product name, that's a super targeted buyer. So that's very, very important. They, they've, they already know that there's a problem and they already know that there's an issue and they probably know that this product may help them with whatever it is that they're looking for. So they turn to Google and they're going to do a search. And that's where the launch jacking process comes in play. So I want to show you one that is just going down right now. And I've been number one for the majority of the launch. If you look at this, it's called Lead Conversion Square. Now, this has been uh, heavily promoted over the last couple of couple of weeks. Uh, you'll see we've reached, we're at the number two spot. There's a, a snippet here that's overtaken this. But earlier today, we were number one. But now it looks like I'm in number three spot. So I'm here. And then I've got this one right here with a Google site. So I used a Google site to rank. I've also used this site right here. I did this part of a test uh, for some of my inner circle members to show them some of the things that I did with this particular launch and to show them what I did to, to be able to rank for this particular term. So what happens in this case is people are searching for lead conversion squared or they may search for lead conversion squared review or whatever product it is. But they turn to Google and that's where you have some opportunity. And what launch jacking is, is where you're taking up the spots on the first page. You can do this with YouTube videos and you can rank YouTube videos inside of YouTube because people are turning to YouTube as well for more tutorials and one of more, you know, more 
uh, information on how to use the specific products. And they're also turning to Google, wanting to know more information. So the searcher goes to Google to look for more information about the product. They find your website. You've got all this stuff listed and you actually break down the product and you offer a better bonus. Then guess what? you're going to make the sale at that point. So that's the whole idea behind launch jacking. This is the strategy that I personally used to really make my first money online. Now I had sold products and I'd done all kinds of stuff, but never really made a substantial amount of money. You know, I made a few hundred bucks here and there, but nothing to keep the lights on, nothing to like really do any kind of damage. And keep in mind, I was starting my digital marketing business with over a hundred thousand dollars in credit card debt alone, plus the houses and the cars and all that other stuff. So the first time I really made any money was because I was talking to a, another person that was in this JV group and they said, look, they're doing these launches and you ought to like, you ought to join this group and you ought to see what they're doing. And I thought affiliate marketing was a complete sham. I really did. I didn't think there would be any money to be made in it. And so uh, I reluctantly, you know, joined this group and I thought, well, maybe, you know, maybe I can learn something, right? I, I didn't, I didn't really give it any uh, the time of day really to really put any effort into it. One day out of just complete frustration, because I'd had some stuff happen uh, where some sales had bought, just completely bombed. And I was like, you know what? What the hell, right? What the hell? I'm going to give this a go. <laughs> see what happens with it. And so I emailed my small list. I had a, a list of just a, a few hundred, maybe a, a couple thousand people. It wasn't a whole lot. Didn't have a whole lot of interaction with it. But I emailed the list and I emailed them to a blog post. And at the time, this has been so long ago, at the time, nobody, there wasn't a term called launch jacking. This wasn't a strategy that people were going out and doing. But at the time, I ended up making sales on this and I and I, I did pretty well. I ended up, you know, on the top 20 of the leaderboard and I was like, holy cow, this whole thing works. And so I thought that the sales had come from my email list. But the reality was, I, after I started checking things, I noticed I ranked several of the top spots. I ranked number one, and then I had other, sp other spots ranking in the top as well, because I was the only one that was really blogging about this particular product. And I thought, you know what? There's something here. So that's when I, I started then looking at future launches, and I started building that website specifically devoted to these particular products, and I started building out a, a bigger authority site that I could uh, that I could do reviews on and things like that. And uh, I think the most that I made, I made like somewhere around seventy thousand dollars in sales inside of a seven to ten day period. Now I didn't keep all that money. Uh, commission was a half of that. I think it was like fifty percent commission. Plus there was some refunds that backed out of that, but. At the time, that was the biggest money that I had ever seen in my entire life, especially in that short of period of time. We're talking like seven to ten days time frame. It was nothing. You know, it was just one promotion, one you know, one or two pages that I created, and I created a couple of videos, and voila, we had made a whole lot of money, right? So that's what launch jacking is. That's what actually helped me dig my way out of this credit card debt that I had put myself into. Now Let's talk about where you can find out about the launches. Now, there's two spots that you can look at for digital marketing or internet marketing related launches. The first one is munchai.com. You can see this right here, munchai.com. You can come in and you can look and see which products are actually going to be going live. And then there's another one called JV Notify Pro. And this one, you can actually sign up to the list and they'll send you updates as to what launches are coming down and what you can, uh, what you can start promoting and you can get on their list and find out. Also, if you've got other people that you've promoted in the past, or you, you start getting on these people's JV list, you will start seeing that other people are offering private promotions as well. So sign up to you know some of the JV list, and you will see that people, sometimes they don't put them on these boards. They will just do a private promotion. I've done several of these where that literally there was no competition in those scenarios because I was on their JV list, and they're sending out a thing that says, "Hey, we're you know we're launching this in you know two months or three months or whatever. We'd love to have you on board." And they didn't even put it on these these public boards because they were just sending it out to their existing JV list. And so that's another way, that's another strategy that you can use for this whole launch jacking uh, technique. But I want to talk about and shift gears here. There's three key elements that you've got to have, or I feel like you've got to have, in order to be successful with the whole launch jack strategy. And this is going to help 
help you improve your conversions. This is going to improve your SEO and help you actually rank for these. And it's also going to help you as it relates to if you're building a list and, and help you with your, your list as well. So let's dig into uh, this program called MindNode Pro. This is my mind mapping software that I use. But there's three key elements to making this work. So the first one is you've got to, in in my opinion, I believe you've got to create a video. You don't have to, but I believe like video is such a crucial element because what video is allows you to do is, is several things. Number one, it allows you to connect with your audience. Okay, so I'm doing this video and you can see me, you can see I'm a real person. I'm not somebody that's fake or phony or anything like that. You can see that I'm I'm talking to you and I'm not some robot or anything like that. So it allows me to connect with you. I can tell you some of my experiences. I shared with you in just this video how I was over $100,000 in credit card debt when I started my business. That's something that nobody else can tell because that's my story. So I can connect with you on a personal level using video. The other thing is this gives us a YouTube video that we can rank, okay? So we can rank this video inside of YouTube because people, there's more people going to YouTube to do searches for these products, wanting to see demos and demonstrations and coupon codes and see any kind of of the best bonus that they can get as best pricing or anything like that. So this gives us an asset that we can use. We can rank this in YouTube, but guess what? We can also rank this inside of Google as well because Google will display a lot of times, as you saw in the search results, they will display uh, videos. So we can connect with our audience better and we we can build a bond there with video unlike anything else. And this also gives us a video that we can, you know, then in turn rank inside of Google and we can also rank inside of YouTube. So what I do is that we take the video. The next thing we do is we create a blog post. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to embed this video and I'm going to, I'm going to title this with the product name and, and all that sort of stuff and have the SEO benefit to the video, but I'm going to write a blog post and this blog post is going to be a review post. So it's going to be a review style post, Uh, you know, product name plus review. And then it'll be something like, does this really work? Or inside look, here's how to get an inside look or something along those lines, right? That's what I'm going to do is this review. But I'm going to take In addition to the content that I'm putting out on this review, I'm going to take this video and I'm going to embed it inside this blog post. Okay. Now what happens here is this notifies Google and YouTube that, hey, this this video has been embedded on this blog and it's going to actually give it some SEO juice as well. So this is going to help this video rank. It's going to help, you know, connect with the, the audience, the reader, right? And it's also going to help with your blog post because... In most cases, what I found in my experience is when somebody lands on a blog post, they're going to be inclined to click on a video. And that's going to help your time on site of people that are looking at your review post. If they're looking at your review post and they're watching the video, guess what? That increases your engagement on the video, but it also increases your engagement on the review post. So that way that's going to, you know, it's like killing two birds with one stone by simply having the video embedded on the actual blog post. And it's real easy to do. You just click to embed the video and you copy that and you put it into your post. Okay. Now this blog post, not to get too technical, not to go into so much detail, it's going to be overwhelming, but I just want to let you know I'm using WordPress, a WordPress blogging platform to pull all this off uh, because that is hands down the best SEO platform that I've found on the planet. So the third and final element that you want to use, and this is very, very important, is you want to email your list. Okay. Now, even if you don't have a huge list or no list at all, uh, you want to start building your email list. But you want to email you want to email your list this blog post, and the reason that you want to do that is because that's showing Google that you've got some you've got some traction and you've got some traffic that's coming to that actual review post. So this is all helping you in a synergistic kind of way because one, you're you're building up you know you're connecting with your list. Okay, you're connecting with your list and you're telling people, you know, hey, this could help you and you're showing a demonstration of the actual product or you're giving a breakdown of the product. But also this is going to have a synergy effect with your review post and video. 
because the if if you're treating your list right, these are your people, right? These are your people, and you say, hey, I just published this post. Not sure if you're you know not sure if you saw this or not, but X Y Z has just rolled out this you know super killer awesome <laughs> uh, product, and uh, and I want you to I want you to take a look at this review that I just did. And I also put together a, a kick ass bonus that I think you'll dig, and so you send them to this blog post. And you then have the chance of making sales as well. So not only, you know, not only is this going to help you from the standpoint of SEO and ranking the videos, but also you're going to be making sales and it has a synergistic effect with everything as it relates to video as well as your blog post. So it all works hand in hand having these three key elements on your site. So this is what is is working as it relates to creating a successful launch jack now also we're going to be you know when we do this when we get behind a product we'll mail multiple times we don't just mail once and say hey here's this you know here's this review we're going to probably come up with a couple of different angles maybe a couple of different bonuses that way we can talk about differently in the email so we can hit it kind of sort of from different angles but this gives you a good idea of how to make launch jacking work now finally what i'm going to leave you with and this is super, super important because this kind of derailed me for a, a bit of time. The reality is, is not all of them going to take off. That's just the that's just part of the game. So what you want to do is you want to use that to your advantage. Now, how do you do that? Well, you have to go into it knowing that not all of them are going to take off. So don't set your expectations and say, oh, that Pierce guy was saying I'm going to make 70K. No, I'm not saying that at all. I'm saying that was one deal. I've had other deals that didn't do well at all. I had some that I haven't made any money at all. So just realize this is a numbers game. And you can apply this to more than just this whole launch jack. This is something that you can apply to, you know, evergreen products and things like that, but it's it's called launch jack and where you're targeting product names and you get paid an affiliate commission for by outranking everybody else. Now, the other thing that you want to pay a special close attention to is be sure that that this knowing this is a numbers game, be sure that you're promoting multiple products. Like I said, you don't want to go into this thing where you think, "Oh, I'm going to make 70k on this and then the launch bombs." then what right so you want to promote multiple stuff also when you do this and you're creating it this way this blog post that you've created all of this goodwill toward you've created a review post and you've done seo on this particular post the more content that you're creating inside your own platform and you're in in uh in in your in, on your website in your youtube channel the more content that you produce the more people that you get on your email list, the better off that you're going to be able to rank in the future. So not only is this going to help you rank for this particular term, but it's also, if you play the numbers, it's gonna help you rank for future stuff as well. So this is how launch jacking works. Uh, this has been a, a video request that I've had for some time now. Hope you find this beneficial. Hope you find this helpful. And uh, be sure if you enjoy this video, be sure to check out my free training. Uh, this is going to show you how to take this strategy and even more to the next level using affiliate marketing. So this is Derek Pierce. Again, thanks for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with someone. I really appreciate it.